Thank you for visiting my channel. If you do enjoy the message, please like, share, comment, even subscribe. So let's get a few messages when it comes to love. Let's see what messages we get. For the collective, what does the collective need to know when it comes to love? What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages? So we do have overwhelm. The stress from this is draining me. So somebody could feel stressed. Let's see. At the bottom, in reverse, we have indecisive. So somebody could honestly be making a decision. With the indecisive being in reverse, they could be making a decision about something that has them stressed out. Whatever's draining them, they're going to start making a decision about it. Any messages, ancestor spirit guides. Any messages? Okay, and we do have gossip. I'm afraid of what other people will think. So somebody could be making a decision that has them stressed, but they could fear. Like they said, they're in fear of what other people may think about the decision that they're going to make. So what do we have at the bottom? We have neglected at the bottom. So they don't want to be neglected anymore. They want to come out of this. They want to come out of this stressful situation. But they are in fear of the gossip that may go around or what may be said about them. Let's see. What are the messages? What are the messages? They could be leaving somebody and that person might be going around saying that this person was a bad partner, bad father, bad mother. Who knows? You know, a liar, a cheater. It says re regret. I wish this never happened. So this person is regretting the decision that they did make. And now they want to go back and fix it. So we have forgiveness. I'm struggling to over to get over the past. So this person wants forgiveness. Maybe this person wants to come back to you because they chose the wrong person and they're in regret about this person. Let's get one more and then we'll get some another deck. Yes, that's the spirit guide. What is the messages? So if this person chose somebody over you, they know that it's going to really hit the fan when they do make the decision to leave. They regret being with this person and they know this person is probably vicious and, you know. So we have Chaser here. I don't want to chase anymore. Hmm. Okay, so we got secrets in reverse. So, you know, it could be some secrets coming out. Maybe this per the secret is this person doesn't want to chase anymore. This person doesn't want to chase whatever they've been addicted to or running after. They don't want to chase it anymore. Maybe they were running after this other person they thought was better and they don't want to do that anymore. They probably see how this person is. Let's just speak out. the messages? What are the messages? Please give me more messages. Let's get some on this regret card here. What is this regret card? Yes, that's your spirit, guys. What is this regret? What does this person regret when it comes to love? What does this person regret when it comes to love? So we do have the runner. The runner in a codependent relationship, fear of intimacy, listening to ego. So this person regrets being in their ego when it came to you. Let's see, is there anything else about this regret? So we do have the coughing card, ending, bringing new beginnings, growth, change, liberation, trans, transition. So this person wants to end that. So this person regrets running from you and they want to put that to an end. They finally want to buckle down and be with you. So what is this gossip card? What is this gossip and overwhelmed? Why is this gossip and overwhelmed card here? Ancestor Spirit Guide, please give me clear messages. What is the gossip and overwhelmed? Please. So we do have mirror, mirroring each other, self-image, relationship, reflect our wounds, introspection. So yeah, whoever they met is just like them, is mirroring them. 
And then we do have Cupid's arrow, having faith and love is coming, invitation or meeting, hesitation. So this person probably thought they met the one, but deep down this person that they met was just like them. Maybe this person was lying and gossiping about you and they found somebody just like them. And even on the back, we have backstab, heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attacks. So yeah, they're scared this person might be gossiping, might get them hurt or something like that. You know, and this person was probably doing the thing, same thing to you. So we do have girl with a snake, empath, narcissist paradigm, being charmed, used, enabled boundaries. So yeah, they met somebody just like them. They scared this girl with a snake is going to be gossiping about them and things like that. Mirroring them. Whatever they did to you, this person is going to be doing to them. So let's see. What is this chaser? What is the chaser card? Ancestor spirit, guys. What is the chaser? Chaser, please. Yes, that's the spirit, guys. What is the chaser? So this person that they met, this girl with a snake, has really got them stressed out. So the chaser card, it says, well, hands, hand of cards. Take a chance. A risk being strategic options, not showing hands gambling. So this person wants to take a risk. This person wants to take a risk to get you back. They don't want to have to chase after you, but they do want you back. Even at the bottom, we have kisses, unconditional love. We have giving and receiving affection, falling in love. So this person wants you to just open back up to them. And when they come in and take a risk and send little love gestures, they just want you to open back up and, you know, be open to being back with them. And this is Chaser card. Let's see. We have girl talk, time with friends, moving on, happily single, living in the moment, having fun. Right. They don't want to have to chase after you. But they see that you're living in the moment, having fun with your girls and moving on. We do have both receiving what you need, progressing, arriving, moving on, closure issues. So this person has closure issues, but they still want you to be receiving when they come back in. Let's see. Let's see. Is there anything else? Let's see. Is there anything else? And we do have coffee cup, meeting, conversing, savoring the moment, feeling uplifted, friendship. So this person wants to come in and try to be like a friend to you. They want to talk to you. They want, you know, to feel your loving energy again. But even on the back, we still have stabbed in the back. Heartbreak, pain, separation, de uh, deception, shocking attack. So be careful because this person, whoever this person was dealing with, might try to hurt you, might try to hurt them. Who knows? So just watch out for that. Let's see. This girl with the snake is dangerous. So let's see. Let's see if there's anything this person has to say. Anything this person wants to say. Let's just describe that. Anything this person wants to say to the collector. I want to say. So it says, I can't do this right now. Okay, like I said, this person is feeling overwhelmed, so they feel like they can't do this right now. It says, it's all too much. So yeah, this person is really stressing. Really stressing about this situation, your situation, distressed. They met their match with this other person. They want to get you back and let you be open to them, even though they treated you like the other person is treated. No, no, it's a lot going on for this person. Let's see, anything else this person wants to add? Anything else this person might want to say? So, so let's ask one. Why do I feel so lost? So this person can't figure out why they feel so lost. They don't know who they are. They feel lost. Let's see. It says, if I could go back in time, I would handle us differently. So this person, like I said, is in regret. They wish that they would have never ran from you. They wish they would have ended that. You know, just came in and been who you wanted them to be. So now they're just going through it. They do want you back, though. So I do hope that you enjoyed the message. Thank you.